Hi, and welcome to the Palo Alto Network's Tech Pubs video series. In this video, we will go over how to install and set up the Panorama Interconnect plugin. Panorama Interconnect allows you to manage multiple Panorama management server nodes from a single Panorama controller. This plugin simplifies the deployment and operational management of large scale firewall deployments by allowing you to centrally manage policy and configurations from a single Panorama controller. First, we must obtain the Certificate Authority Certificate for the Panorama Management Server you will designate as the Panorama Controller. If one does not already exist, you can generate a new Certificate Authority Certificate or import an existing Certificate Authority Certificate. In this video, we will generate a new Certificate Authority on the Panorama Controller. To obtain the Certificate Authority, select Panorama, Certificate Management, and then Certificates, and then click Generate. For the Certificate Type, select Local, enter the name of the Certificate Authority in the Certificate Name field, and in the Common Name field, enter the IP address or domain name of the Panorama Controller. Leave the Sign By field empty, and check Certificate Authority. Once you have finished configuring the Certificate Authority, click Generate. Then click Commit, Commit to Panorama. Next, we will generate a unique certificate for each Panorama node signed by the Certificate Authority. Repeat this for each Panorama node that will be managed by Panorama Interconnect. In the same Certificates window, Click Generate. For the certificate type, select Local. For the certificate name, enter the name of the specific certificate. And in the common name, enter the IP address or domain name of the Panorama node. And then finally, in the Signed By field, select the certificate authority. Once you have finished configuring the certificate, click Generate. Then click OK once the certificate has finished generating and commit the configuration to Panorama. We will now export the certificate of the Panorama node. You will need to repeat this for each certificate for each Panorama node to be managed by the Panorama controller. To do this, select the certificate and click Export Certificate. For the file format, select either Base64 Encoded Certificate or Encrypted Private Key and Certificate. Check the Exported Private Key option and then enter the Certificate Password. Once you have set the Certificate Password, click OK. And the exported certificate will be downloaded locally. Once you've generated the Certificate Authority, as well as generated and exported the unique Panorama node certificates, we can go ahead and create the certificate profile on the Panorama controller. To do this, select the certificate profile under the certificate management section, and then add a new profile. Here, you'll need to enter a profile name and select the certificate authority you generated. Once you've finished configuring the certificate profile, click OK and commit to Panorama. Now that we've added a new certificate profile on the Panorama controller and generated and exported the unique Panorama node certificates, we can begin importing the unique certificates to their corresponding Panorama node. You will need to perform this step on the web interface for each Panorama node to be managed by the Panorama controller. In the Panorama tab, select Certificates under Certificate Management and click Import. For Certificate Type, select Local. You will need to enter a certificate name, then click Browse and select the exported certificate. For the file format, 
select the corresponding format with which the key was exported. Then select import private key and enter the certificate password. Once all the information has been entered, click OK, and then commit to Panorama. We can now begin installing and setting up the Panorama Interconnect plugin. First, we will need to download and install the plugin on the Panorama controller and each Panorama node. To do this, select the Panorama tab and then select Plugins and search for Panorama Interconnect. Then download the latest Interconnect plugin version. Once the plugin has been downloaded, install the plugin. And once the plugin has been successfully installed, commit the configuration to Panorama. Once the Interconnect plugin has been successfully installed, a new Interconnect section will appear under the Panorama tab, and we can begin to set up the Panorama controller in Panorama nodes. First, we will set up the Panorama management server that has been designated as a controller. To do this, select the Setup option in the Interconnect space, and then click Edit. In the Server Mode field, select Yes to designate the Panorama as the controller, and then select the certificate profile that we previously created, and then click OK. And commit the configuration to Panorama. Once the commit has finished, the API server on the Panorama management server will restart. To set up the Panorama node, again select the Interconnect Setup option in the Panorama tab, and then click the Edit cog. In the Server Mode field, select No to designate the Panorama as a Panorama node. In the Manager Panorama IP field, enter the IP address of the Panorama controller. And if the controller is in a high availability configuration, enter the IP address of the HA peer here. Next, select the certificate that was imported previously. And if the Panorama node will be in a high availability configuration as well, select the peer certificate. Once you have finished setting up the Panorama node, click OK. and then commit the configuration to Panorama. The API server on the Panorama management server will again need to restart. Please keep in mind that once you configure a Panorama management server as a controller or as a node, it cannot be reconfigured as the other, meaning that you will need to uninstall the Panorama Interconnect plugin on the Panorama management server in order to redesignate it as a controller or as a node. Once you have successfully set up the Panorama controller and all Panorama nodes, you must add the Panorama nodes to the Panorama controller to be managed. To do this, 
select Panorama Nodes in the Interconnect section under the Panorama tab and click Add. You must then enter a name for the node, its serial number, its IP address, and a brief description. Once you have finished entering the information, click OK. And then commit the configuration to Panorama. And then, to verify that the node has been successfully added, ensure that the connection column shows connected. That concludes this video of how to set up the Panorama Interconnect plugin.